Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Trance and Nye. I'm Sam, this is Max, and this is episode 104, where nothing of any significance happens. No, 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 that was last episode. This is episode 104, The Revengeance. So of that entire intro, that's the only thing you take issue with? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's a so pithy campaign slogan. It's a stack of pithy campaign oh, don't slogans. Don't fool with those. Would want to be caught on national TV with my drawers down again. Uh, have you noticed the way his jaw moves? He is literally a nutcracker. That's terrifying. That's what they call his House wife. Representatives Look, we got a magazine. House of Representatives and Gardens, but that doesn't do anything. How about the Nutcracker Washington? What does this do? Hi. I'm George Washington. Oh, dear God. Anyone need their nuts cracked? <laughs> Please don't make fun of George Washington. D d oh, oh, dear God. Okay, what about the star pill? Does that do anything? <laughs> like, I... Throw pillows shaped like stars. Throw pillow. And look, they're stripes. Since actual stars are shaped more like throw pillows. So, yeah, uh, I need to again reiterate Let's say that. they're throwing stars. You're terrible. So once yeah. again, we have to reiterate that we have no idea how to play. Like, well, I've never played this uh, this uh, version or this like episode one of four of Santa Max. So I have no idea what I'm doing. What's in this rat hole? Looks like there are rats in the Oval Office. One of them sitting Sam behind the desk. Finally done it. A straight line so easy, even I won't touch it. Oh. Let's see. How about the decorative urn? This urn says Fluffy on it. In loving Wasn't memory that of Fluffy. G. Harding's nickname? How about the commemorative plates? plates? commemorate the core values of freedom-loving peoples everywhere. Baseball, Eating apple pie, and, and horn dogs. Sticks? Exactly. Okay, what do the boxing gloves do? Roosevelt's boxing gloves, encased in lucite. TR or FDR? Roosevelt. DR, I think. <laughs> Roosevelt's wow. boxing gloves like that. This is either an early draft of the Declaration of Independence. the Declaration of Independence in here. of Lithuania. Oh, just an early draft. Yeah. What's the, what's the pot of plant? Please plant make this important. The Vice President of the United States. Ha ha, he made a joke. To tell the By the way, did you notice that the potted plant <coughs> has, <coughs> has uh, five star-shaped leaves? Vice President of the United States? It is hard yes, to tell the and? difference. Nothing. Picture. If you're insinuating it's a marijuana plant, yes, it looks nothing like one. I'm, I'm making the assumption. Close. Who is this sure a picture of? Is. That's not Washington. No, it's not. That's one of the developers. It has to be one of the developers. U.S. Senate yep. Talent Show, second place. My finest hour. U.S. Senate Talent Show, second place. Let's look at the calendar. Hands off, boy. That's my presidential calendar. Did you just call me boy? That's racist. Why does, why does the seal, the presidential seal, have? Wow. That's a can of gas, and what's the other one? Cigarettes, as far as I can tell. Yep, cigarettes. And we the yep. eagle, and the eagle smoking. <laughs> yup. That so it says everything, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. See, what's in the globe? Is nice going to show globe. us? Amazing. Wonderful. How often I need it in this job. Just gigantic. Okay. Right, says America. How about the how about the eagle scout badges? It's a bunch of merit badges from the weasel scout. Weasel scouts. There you go. I got one of those once, but they took it away when they found out what I used for things. <laughs> wow. <laughs> And hey, look, the eagle over here has money and guns in it. Take a look at that. Check that out. I love this country. I love you, Max. Oh, how about the snow globe? Nothing in this room is interactable, this which is kind of interesting. Has a little Apollo 13 inside. What happens when you shake it? I'm afraid to find out. <laughs> That's terrible. Okay, what's this camera do? Anything? Hands off the camera. Okay, I'm not allowed to touch anything in this room. <coughs> okay, so let's go ahead and just ignore them. Let's go to the war room. Because no one's going to stop me from doing that. No one enters the war room. Except for that guy. That's it. You two are coming with me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This one guy just manhandled both of us out the door. And stay out. Now I have to get stay back there. to the president. He's not supposed to be alone. Excuse me. Oh God, what are you doing here? Oh, welcome, Governor Wizard. Well, you see, when a man loves a chicken, Wizard is a governor. Governor Wizard? Hey, who the hell? Than a washed-up, urination-loving child star. Apparently, he's a governor. Hello. How? Well, Arnold Schwarzenegger pulled it off. I mean, 
Hmm. Let's be fair. White paint, Christmas lights, and okay, a that small still door. Yes! Door. How do you run? <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger! Vote for me or I will crack your head like an overripe watermelon! That's you know, about right. We're opposed to, we the people! Oh no, someone said we! Pretty Does much, it... yeah. That's, I mean... No, sir. I said soda abuse. Okay, so apparently it's I had to get thrown out because this wouldn't issue. have happened otherwise. Was I? No, comprende, son. But I'm speaking he has... English. Ah, oh, are, are you two fellas the interpreters? He has it's got to be time. a puppet. Darndest thing. We just had a couple imposters in here. Dead ringers for you two. Uh, uh, Were they I... walking around examining he everything? He has to be a puppet. Everyone in pointless conversation? No, I think Those he's just ludicrously dumb. No, I mean, you look at the way the jaw moves Help and the way he's like, potentate, he's got to be a puppet. A dang word. But that doesn't make sense. I don't even have an accent. Was there even I can't momento, understand you. Por favor. Impatient little guy, ain't he? Okay, so can I go into the war? Oh, it's Libertyville land. We never Liberty escaped that. Light for this room, just as America is. Don't a light say it. Metaphor is such an ugly quality in furniture. Okay, better. Okay, I'm trying to avoid talking to Wizard. What happens if I get thrown out again? Hey, FBI agent, do you recognize us? We were just in here trying to go through this door. Those chairs no look like bacon. The war room. That's nope, it. same thing happens. Okay. Out. Skip that. Okay. So nothing nothing changed and doing stay that. Out. Now I am Is anyone there? Hello? And no, nobody else comes up. So Hello. we gotta do something with Wizard, apparently. So we'll just go back into the White House because no one's gonna stop us. Hi, we're back. Uh, are, are you two fellas the inter Darndest thing. We just ha okay, so that just repeated itself. Okay, uh, I you know what? Really? I didn't Those investigate. Chairs. I didn't investigate the uh, the desk. What about, what about this ribbon? Hey now, that's my super special top secret ribbon. Super special top secret ribbon. Okay. Uh, how about the national budget? This should be interesting. Stand Animal back, areas. son. That there's the Independence Hall, budget. the Alamo, Statue of Liberty. We gotta do something. Gets done with that. Hey, look, it's Chuckles. Hey, man. Do you work here? What tipped you off? We're freelance police, buddy. <laughs> this is a national uh, emergency. I love sarcastic And we jerks. don't appreciate your sassy mouth. Yeah. Auditions for new White House pet down the hall. I like this guy. This He's got an attitude. End in violence. Can Ooh, we shoot this him? This guy's voice sounds familiar. Do you recognize him, Max? Half the time yeah, I he was in the last episode. You, Sam. I'm over here, little buddy. Who said that? Wonderful. You seem familiar. Do I know Weren't you, you in episode 103? Yeah. I'm that voice in the back of your head that tells you to mind your own business. You sound like a mobster, and, and you look like you fit in a tone. teddy bear outfit. It. You're the yep. pit boss from the toy mafia. And Sam gets I it. Congratulations. You smell a nosy dog who's going to get smacked if he don't stop asking questions. Hey, that sounds like a threat. What's a toy mafia man doing around right here? I'm curious. Toy mafia got to do with the Secret Service. Other than controlling what the president. Toy mafia. Oh, he's good, Sam. He's really good. He knows exactly how to get around us. The secret us. organization you inducted me and Max into in a time-honored ceremony. The one that we infiltrated repeatedly <laughs> just and then won't blew stop up talking, in a fiery they? explosion of death and property damage. This is not going to end well. I was going to casually forget to mention that part, Max. That's a very entertaining <laughs> story, Chowderheads. Now, run along and play whilst I protect the leader of our country. Protect him from what? From you? I suspect foul play. Somebody may have hypnotized the president while you weren't looking. Or you hypnotized the president. There we go. Very are. funny. I'm so glad that Sam commented on What do you do here? Exactly, what do you do here? Are you a people person? What do you do around here? I give out free t-shirts to the visitor who asked the dumbest question of the day. I come Please in an XL. My apologies. Oh my. Husky boys sizes. Oh, oh, darn. Darn. And so does your mouth. I thought you were on Oh, that side, sucks. Max. <clears throat> he made I the joke I wanted like to make. I, him, Sam. I made it first though. So you're a bodyguard? Maybe? You're yes, no. President's personal bodyguard? What happens if I shoot you? you? quick. We need to have a private meeting with the president. National security. Can I shoot you? Go right ahead. I meant private, as in wait outside and we'll call you when we need you. And national Are you security, really allowed to get a in, we need private to the president place on the head with the president not this easily? Your gift for subterfuge no. is uncanny, Max. <laughs> in <laughs> fact, as in were this the actual you. U.S., they'd be long dead before they even reached the building. I think the whole put or call up the Secret Service agent thing and put them on, the, on hold would actually work, though. 
actually mm. no, they they don't respond. But they just ignore your phone calls. Yes, unless well, no, you get the living shit arrested out of you for actually knowing the contact line and abusing it. What if you're just calling to say hi? That's abusing it. So how do they get phone calls? They don't, unless they're absolutely necessary, like, shit's going down, get the eagle to safety. Or, holy fuck the nukes, holy fuck. If Pretty much those are the only phone calls they accept. If you don't want to have conversations, you shouldn't have a phone. There's a reason why we have email, texts. Yes, but there's also a reason why they have certain dedicated phones. These are for emergencies. Email, texts. Yeah, not as good. Hmm. Guys, if you think that email and text should be the uh, preferred medium of the Secret Service to communicate with each other, please leave a comment in the comment section. Let's get a petition going. If you want to see more of this, and specifically me messing with Chuckles here, please hit the like button and then hit subscribe so you can see it when I inevitably do. And I'll see you guys later. Later, viewers. And remember, don't stick a hamster up your ass. While it seems fun in the movies, it's not. Trans speaks from experience. Good night, everybody!